today at Ultimate Motors with a 2016 BMW 528 X-Drive. Just do a quick walk around. Has blacked out front kidney grills, heads up display, has Bluetooth audio and hands-free calling, navigation, etc. It has all-wheel drive. The rear seat has a center pass-through for skis, golf clubs, and more. Powered by a turbocharged inline four-cylinder, making upwards of 300 horsepower. Let's take a look inside. It's a dark brown wood trim. Black interior. On the left side, your four automatic windows, power folding mirrors, adjustment for your mirrors. Down there, you have two person driver memory, headlight controls, button for your heads up display. Left side of the wheel, your cruise control settings. Downshifting your paddle shifters. On the right side, you have modes, scroll wheel, volume up or down, hands-free commands, as well as picking up Bluetooth calls, and upshift. Let's start it up, see how it sounds. <laughs> screen display, hit the board computer button right here, average miles per gallon, right now it's not driving so it's not in there, average speed, date, nothing, your range, back to your miles per gallon. Center, you have BMW's iDrive, control with this knob right here. Take a farther look into it. We've got a menu, pressure multimedia, CD, music collections, tone for bass, etc. We have the radio, AM, FM, and satellite radio. Telephone for hands free calling. Your navigation. You have a map. Right now it's taking up half the screen. The right half can be two, it's a split screen setup. We can stop that. I turn it off split screen, full size map. We'll go to the office settings, office section, contacts, messages, any notes you might have. You'll be able to connect to Drive, it has different apps, a web browser, as well as messages. Vehicle information, status, your tire pressure, oil level, if you have service, any check, check engine information, sport displays, shows you how much power and torque power and torque are making, excuse me. Lastly, we have settings, climate, lighting information, eco pro mode doors and key information for the main key, valet key, door chimes, etc. Software update. Center you have two vents, hazards, door lock. BMW has a climate control system which is pretty different than most other car manufacturers. Normally you leave it in the middle with the cold and hot square showing. If you want to get really hot for a quick period of time, show the red square. If you want to get really cold, show the blue square. When you're normally driving, have both squares showing. And adjust the automatic temperature to these knobs down below. It is dual zone. Fan speed, off. Raise or lower it. 
defrost. You can sync them, turn your AC on or off, recirculation, directional settings. Not sure if you can see it right there. It has a heads up display as well. You can turn on and off. For the blow, got two cup holders, cigarette lighter, or a 12 volt outlet. Storage for your key. Continuing blow, you have different drive modes. You have sport and comfort. Sport, comfort, eco pro. The top you have Sport Plus, turns off DSC. Button for your trash control on or off. Downhill speed control, hill descent, or your parking sensors. Press this, sensors come up, turn on brightness and more. Parking aid lines, because of a backup camera as well. Electronic parking brake, auto hold on hills. You can use this knob to control the iDrive, as I said before, or these buttons above. It has three door garage home link, reading lights and dome lights, an SOS button, passenger airbag light, sunroof opening and closing, or tilting it. Fit with the back seat. Two vents, storage, 12 volt outlet. Small center console. Storage in the middle. Two cup holders as well. Open up the trunk. Trunk is automatic, I just stopped it on accident. Extra floor mats, cargo net, tethering points, a pass through for your skis, golf clubs, and more. More storage down here. Access for emergency gas lid opening. Extra storage down below as well. Small toolkit in here. Let's pop open the hood. Trunk release, hood latch release. Turbocharged force on your engine makes about 315 ish horsepower. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you have any more questions, feel free to contact us at ultimatemotorsva.com or on Facebook at Ultimate Motors VA. Thank you.